Hey, what's going on, Coin Up TV subscribers? Robert Walkner here. In this video, we're going to break down the hot games of March 2016. So as you guys can see, the list is pretty big for March 2016. I thought February 2016 was a big month, but it looks like we have a lot of games in March. These are the new games coming out as listed upon by Wikipedia's website. If I miss a game, let me know in the comments below so we can discuss a game that we missed. This does not include DLC, it doesn't include toys, the life stuff, expansions, um, things like that. It's just new games and new games that are being ported over to new systems. So let's get started with March 1st, Alakin's Gun coming out for the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One, Bro Force for the PlayStation 4, Depania Doomsday for Windows PC, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Far Cry Primal for the Windows PC, Heavy Rain will be over on to the PlayStation 4, Return to Popolo's Cross, A Story of Seasons Fairy Tale will be on the Nintendo 3DS, the Witch and the Hunted Knight Revival Edition will be on the PlayStation 4. Tron Runner will move over to the Xbox One. X-Blaze Code Embryo will be on Windows PC. March 2nd, Blast Blue Chrono Phantasma Extend will be on the Windows PC. March 3rd, Black Desert Online for Windows PC. March 4th, we have a game called Action Hank on the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. Into the Stars for Windows PC. Big one here, The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD will be for the Nintendo Wii U. March 8th we have Shard Light for the Windows PC. Then also that week we'll see the release of Tom Clancy's The Division for Windows PC, Xbox One, and the PlayStation 4. March 10th we have The Guest coming over to Windows PC. March 11th Alakin's Gun will be on Windows PC. Hitman's Intro Pack will be for Windows, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. WWE 2K16 will be out for Windows PC. March 15th, we'll see the release of EA Sports UFC 2 for the PlayStation 4, the Xbox One. Also that week, Need for Speed for Windows PC. March 18th, we'll have Myron Sonic at the Rio 2016 Olympic Games coming for the Nintendo 3DS. Then a big one that week also, Pokemon Tournament will be out for the Nintendo Wii. March 22nd, Republic for the Windows, Mac, PlayStation 4, iOS, and Android. Also, Stranger of Sword City for the Xbox One and the PlayStation Vita. Trackmania Turbo will be out for Windows PC and the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. March 23rd, we get Alienation for the PlayStation 4. March 24th, we'll see the release of Dead or Alive Extreme 3 for the PlayStation 4, the PS Vita. Killer Instinct Season 3 will be Windows PC and Xbox One. Slain for the Windows PC. March 25th, we'll see Hyrule Warriors Legends come out for the Nintendo 3DS. Then on March 28th, we'll start seeing video games getting rolled out for the Oculus Rift. The first one will be Adrift. Adrift will be out for Windows PC, Oculus Rift, Kronos, same thing, Edge of Nowhere, Windows, Oculus Rift, Eve Valkyrie for Windows, Oculus Rift. If you're getting an Oculus Rift, let me know in the comments below if you're getting into the, the VR scene in 2016. And then at the end of the month, March 31st, we'll see the release of Star Ocean, Integrity, and Faithlessness for the PlayStation 4. Whew, there it is, out of breath once again. Lots of games coming out, but not quite as many high-profile games as we saw last month, February, we had Street Fighter V, we have Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. Uh, I think the big game here that stands out is definitely Tom Clancy's The Division. We got to play some of that beta, we got to demo that at E3, we got to see that for the last few years, and now The Division will finally be out. I know a lot of gamers want to jump into that, check that out. I think some of the Destiny hype is maybe waning a bit, so The Division can kind of swoop in there and get in on some of that multiplayer sort of shooting hype sort of thing. Uh, looking at this list, you know, I'm curious about the Oculus Rift stuff. Adrift seems to be like the game that will be maybe the Oculus, Oculus Rift um, first game that kind of pushes the envelope with VR on that. 
Finally, looking at the list, I'll also give some props to The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD coming over to the Wii U, and then also Pokemon Tournament for the Nintendo Wii U. I think a lot of people may jump on that, do some fighting. So let me know in the comments below which games you're most excited about for March 2016. I know if you're a Disney Infinity Collector, we got Battlegrounds March 15th. I'm excited about that. Some other cool things coming out for Amiibo and Skylanders. We got Easter this month as well. So get ready to have some time off to play some video games and catch up. So that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time.